Water Filter Micron A micron is a unit of measurement in the metric system. A micron is equal to one millionth of a meter and one thousandth of a millimeter, also known as a micrometer or mu. It is used to measure tiny things and is ideal for measuring objects too small to be seen by the naked eye. For example, human red blood cells are 5 microns. The average diameter of a human hair is 100 microns. Most people see nothing smaller than 40 microns with the naked eye. Micron measurement units are used to measure the size of contaminated particles and the size of openings in filter media, that is, the media's micron rating. A 1 micron water filter can filter out particulates 1 micron or larger. Therefore, it's essential to know the size of particulates you want to remove from the water. Thus, you can choose a corresponding size filter. Please note that a higher pressure is needed to push the water through a smaller micron. Also, smaller micron filters may cause a pressure drop in your water filter system. Remember, the suggested life of any water filter is an estimate. If you are experiencing a pressure drop in your water system, this could be the signs of improper micron size, filters saturated with particles, or it could be at the end of filter service life. A typical whole house water sediment filter can range from 5 to 100 microns, depending on the water quality. A gradual sediment filter system may be needed to prevent filter clogs if you have excessive particulates in the water. Depending on the demand and filtration method for regular drinking water, a typical carbon block filter is rated at about 5 microns and is suitable for removing the most visible particles. However, ions like fluoride, lead, sodium, and calcium will require finer micron filters or different filtration methods to remove from water. A membrane is a thin layer of semi-permeable material that separates substances when a driving force is applied across the membrane. Due to the increased awareness of water contamination, households increasingly use membrane processes to remove contaminants. Ultrafiltration and reverse osmosis are two popular filtration technology used to filter out smaller particulates in the water, such as proteins, gelatin, virus, and heavy metals. An ultrafiltration membrane can filter the water down to around 0.01 or 1 one hundredth of a micron and does not require a booster pump or a water storage tank. A reverse osmosis membrane can filter the water down to near 0.0001 or 1 ten thousandth of a micron. Since the pore size of the RO membrane is tiny, higher pressure is needed to push the water through the membrane. Therefore, a boost pump or a water storage tank may be necessary if the water pressure is low. A wastewater line is also required for a reverse osmosis system because it separates unwanted contaminants from pure water and drains them out through the wastewater line. As you can see, choosing the correct micron size for your water filter system is essential. In the end, it's all down to what's in your water and what you want to remove from the water. Please don't hesitate to contact us if you have questions or concerns. Thank you for watching.